Hey everyone, welcome back. This is DHTV and today is finally the foolproof method on how to remove the Windows 8 charms bar. Now I've went through a few different settings and a few different methods in other videos. Those were kind of hit and miss, but this one here I've tested out on about 30 different Windows 8 computers. Some of them had Windows 8 pre-installed with the computer and some of them were installed after the fact over Windows 7. This worked on all the computers I tried it on, so this should be the foolproof method. Anyway, I encourage you to watch all the way till the end because I got a few Few more settings as well as information to give you anyway guys let's get started All right, so the method we're gonna be using to remove the Windows 8 Charms Bar is through Classic Shell. Now I'm gonna link you in the description of this video here to this page so you can go ahead and download it for yourself. But I did use it in the past and I have a video on that which I'll also link you to where I show you how to get the start menu back on Windows 8. We used Classic Shell for that. So let's get to it. We'll go ahead and click the Download Now button. It'll take a few seconds to start downloading. While it's doing that, I'm gonna remove my Classic Shell so we can get started with the tutorial. Now when your download has completed, you can go to your download section. So by clicking on that little folder there, clicking on downloads, you should see your classic shell setup. We'll go ahead and double tap to open that up. And basically we wanna follow the instructions with the wizard here. So we'll click next, we will accept the terms. Next again. Now in this section here, they're gonna be asking you if you wanna create a start menu folder. Now if you choose to have a start menu with the classic shell here, you can decide if you want that or not by selecting. Also choose the folder and the location you want it. For this example, we're gonna be keeping it in the program file here. Go ahead and click next. You're gonna be asked to put in your password. If you have an administration password, go ahead and do that. Once it's completed, just uncheck that we don't want the readme file right now click finish and you're good we'll go ahead and open up the settings now and the best way I found to do that is to just open up the little folder here click on your C drive you want to then go to program files and then classic shell now within this section here we want the start menu settings so right down here start menu settings and we can close that folder now now when you open up your classic start menu settings here, it may have opened in basic settings or all settings. If it's in basic, it'll look like this. You'll also notice your start menu has appeared by default. So what we need to do is go to all settings here. You wanna go to the start button section at the top. And then there's a space up here where it says enable start menu. If we deselect that, it'll remove the start menu. We'll click okay. Read these instructions because it's gonna tell you how to remove it, but basically all you need to do is right click on the start menu and then exit it and then there you go. Your start menu is no longer there for you, but you can still access it. Again, we'll just uh, go through it and open up our settings the same way we just did. I know I'm taking a long time to get to the charms bar, but there's a lot of things that go on with this, so I don't wanna miss anything. I apologize and thank you for your patience. So we'll open up the settings once again. If you wanna keep the start menu, just enable it again. All right, now that we've got all the boring stuff finally out of the way, we can start removing the Windows 8 charms bar, and this is very easy. So as you can see, if I scroll to the top, right the charms bar hint appears if I scroll down from the right well the hint is there I get the full out charms bar with the clock on the bottom left so what we need to do is go to the Windows 8 settings tab here and where it says disable active corners we're gonna go ahead and select all now if I go to the top right I no longer have the charms bar hint I can no longer scroll down to the bottom to get the full out charms bar the clock is gone and pretty much every corner swipe or active corner is disabled so if you do enjoy that that may be a downfall but definitely guys if you enjoyed this video or found it helpful hit the thumbs up subscribe for more videos like this one I post them Monday Wednesday and Friday on all kinds of things like Windows 8 iPhones the PlayStation 4 which is coming out soon and if you have any questions on this video or anything else related to tech be sure to leave a comment down below happy to help you out thanks for watching guys I will see you in the next one